Hello. This is Kyle. As you can see, I have on a freaking head wrap and some lipstick. Head, all right, and a turtleneck. Um. Okay. First of all, Thanksgiving. Thanksgiving was okay. But of course, like everyone, there's also like issues, and they usually come out on Thanksgiving. I don't know why that is, but it's kind of true. So okay. So, I mean, everybody knows, like, I'm very public about this on YouTube. I don't only like men, I like women. Okay. So, my mom had an issue with an outfit that I wore. And personally, I don't even think I looked that bad. I mean, I had on, like, a striped shirt, a plain old striped shirt I got from H&M. It was black and white, a plain black, uh, black and white striped shirt. And then I had over, like, a black cardigan. And then like some um some skinny jeans, those are very girly. And I had on some flats. And I had on my fedora. This guy had me my fedora. Hell yeah. I had on this hat. Minus the button. I got that recently. So then I wore that uh button. I mean the hat. And I had on like some uh big like nerd glasses. And I don't know why my mom had an issue with it. Like China said that I'm trying to look like a lesbian and I'm like, first of all, how do you even know what a lesbian look like? I wonder how you know. And like I thought I looked pretty casual. I ended up with the hat and glasses. I mean, I was just being like cool and fun or whatever. But she mistook it like as like some kind of like I don't know, but she's crazy. And then, not only that, she told me the other day, like I think around that time, that she hoped me and all my friends that are gay burn to hell. Number one, she have never, ever, ever told me anything like that, ever. So I'm thinking like, you bitch, how can you say that? And then, you know, I don't really care after. I just feel like at that moment, I didn't really think she would ever say that. But like, I knew she was always thinking it, but I didn't think she would actually like say it. I guess she just said it out of anger because she felt that I was dressing very lesbian-like. Mothers, right? So anyway, and then not only that, my stepdad, he also had an issue with the outfit. I'm like, first of all, who told you to wear that shirt? And I said it out loud. He was like, Wanda, I told you not, that's my name. Wanda, unfortunately, I go by Kyle, and he was like, "Wanda, I told you not to wear that. I told you not to wear them glasses and I had to take it off." And I was like, "And I also told you not to wear that shirt, but you're wearing it, right?" And it got really quiet, and everybody started looking at us, and I was like, "Oh, yup, I said it, and what? Yeah, I go hard like in the paint." And then yeah, he got mad, and I was like, "Who told you to wear that shirt?" I was like, "You're wearing it, right?" And like he was so mad or whatever, I didn't care. And I know I ate up every last thing I could possibly eat. And I made sure I took on a plate. And when I got in the house, I ate that plate. And I had like a little bit left. That's pretty much it. Like, Thanksgiving was good. I'm ready for Christmas, man. I don't like, I downloaded like, like 200 songs. And I really want an iPod or something to put it on. Like, I got an uh, MP3 player last year for Christmas. But that like broke after like a month. Like my brother, he cracked the screen. So anyway, that's about it. I'm really like, like rushing Christmas. Like I want Christmas to come on. December just started. Then I'm gonna rush January for the new season of RuPaul's Drag Race. I'm so ready. Like some of the drag queens, to be honest, are like shit. Like I hate to say it, but like they show like the preview where she's like, it's alive. And then, like most of those girls are like garbage. Like it was like a some fat girl and it's like arm or something. I'm like, why would you put that on her? And it was like another one she was bald and it was like another one's like a an actual man and it's just like a little bit of makeup. Like it looks like garbage. Hopefully they clean it up this season. So yeah. That was just a preview, so it could be better. Anyway, World's AIDS Day. At my school they had World's AIDS Day. Like a uh like a health Something they had like all these different businesses, 
<laughs> and honestly, I had the edge. I knew like almost every organization. I was basically saying, hi, I know you, I met you. Because one, I go to Smile. And like, everybody Smile work with. It's practically all those organizations they had in my school. So I was just pointing up here. I was like, oh, I know you. Hey, how you doing? I already know what you about, so you don't gotta give me the big speech. Heard it already. So yeah. I was gonna make like a video of like some pictures and upload it. And use some of the one of those like 200 songs that I made. I mean, not that I made that I downloaded. So yeah, hopefully that'll be up. I'm just gonna use like some old pictures from like my middle school days because I'm in high school now. And it has some recent ones. So yeah. That's about it. That's just going on. I'm ready for Christmas. I'm ready for RuPaul's Drag Race. I'm ready for everything, man. Alright. Is that it? Oh, yeah. On a quick note. So, Smile is trying to recruit for their arts ensemble. And, um, it's for LGBTQ youth. I will make another video about it because this one is getting too long and I hate when my videos get too long. I have a bunch of long ones and nobody watches them. So, yeah. I'm going to cut this one short. Alright, bye. Oh, yeah, now all they play music in the background of my videos. So, if there's, like, a song that you want to, like, know what's the name of it because it sounds interesting, just leave a comment or message me. Your choice. Alright, bye.